Hey everyone, Digital David here. Today we're going to be unboxing and reviewing the MG Flash Force. This is a drop leg holster, so really excited to be reviewing this product for you guys today on my channel. They did send me this to review, but any opinion expressed in this video is truly my own. I just want you guys to be able to see this product hands-on and make the best decision for yourself. You can find this product in my video description below. It'll take you right to Amazon. There'll be a link there and you can read some reviews and see the most accurate pricing. So be sure to do your shopping from that link. That'll help support my channel. Anyways, this is how it's going to come packaged to directly from Amazon. It's just got a nice plastic bag right here with their logo on it. Again, you can see the MG Flash Force. And without anything else to do, let's go ahead and open it up. So you can see we have three contents in the bag. The first one is a thank you note in that they're dedicated to your support. So that's good to have. The second one you can see right there, it's showing you the size of the product and telling you its features and what the ideal use is. So we have the height as 9.8 inches, the width is 3.5 inches. It's lightweight and easy to wear. It's ideal for airsoft, paintball, hunting, military games, range time, and then it's just telling you that this is fully adjustable. So last but not least, we actually have the holster itself and it looks really nice. Great color, it's black, it's made out of polyester. It's got a cool, tag right here with their logo on it. It looks really nice. It's showing you instructions on the back of how to care for this. If it gets dirty, you have to hand wash it, basically is what it's telling you. And this is for people that are right-handed. This will go on your right leg. You have two straps you can see right there hanging down. That'll go around your leg. And then you have this strap right here that'll attach to your belt. And then obviously this is for your weapon. So this is really neat. Now we're gonna go ahead and set it up. I'm back, I have everything attached and adjusted right now. So I have my Glock 19 Gen 4 fitting nice and snug in there. Really comfortable, really nice. Then I got a magazine right here for you just so you can see and I wanted to feel what it's like to have this thing have some weight to it. It's attached, I attached it through my belt right here which is nice so that can carry some weight as well. It's a lot harder to adjust this height than it is to make it tighter around your legs. So if you do want to adjust this, you've got to play around with it. How the Velcro is configured, it's a little goofy. You kind of run out of Velcro if you're like me and you want to keep the gun higher, but you can find a way to get creative and make that work. Everything feels great though, nice and secure, nice and comfortable. I got the buckles on the front. I'm not sure how that looks cosmetically if I'm concerned about, you know, that appearance. I'd love to have the buckles be on the side or maybe even the back, but it's really easy to plug them in right here. So I'll have to do a little more digging around to see if I can somehow take this whole holster off and redo the Velcro or reconfigure it in a way that maybe those can be out of the way. But actually when they're facing the front, that's perfect. So if you're walking around, you'll be really comfortable. You don't want them brushing between your legs right there. So everything looks good. Really impressed with it so far. Um, if you're looking for this type of holster, you definitely want to check it out. It's got a very affordable price on Amazon. So again, just right through the belt. There's a nice clip here too, so you can push that button and attach it right there. So you could leave this on your belt. Really well thought out, really neat piece of tactical gear. Again, it's going to be perfect for airsoft or for the range. And um, yeah, so really nice. Looks great. You can see it on me again right there. Try to model that. And then just a little button right there so you can pull it out and be good to go. So put it right back in and buckle it up and you're set. Well, I hope you found this setup and review helpful today. The link to this product is in my video description below. Please go ahead, check it out. You can see the most accurate price, read some details and some reviews and see if this is the right product for you. I appreciate you being here. Feel free to reach out as well. Ask me any questions, comments, concerns you may have. I'd be happy to answer them for you below or point you in the right direction. Follow me on Instagram, please. Follow me on Facebook. Follow me on Twitter. Like this video. Subscribe to this video. I want you to be around my channel for a long time. Join my newsletter. Check out my website, guys, and I look forward to seeing you all in my next video. Thanks.